Hello there, Magonistas. I'm so excited to share with you today about our end of the year project. This is something that you will be working on all the way up until about the last uh, week of school. And I, it's going to be more of a fun project where you can decide what you want to do with it to show what you've learned this year. Now, let me get into some more details about the project, what it's called, and what you have to do. And ooh, I'm so excited. All right. And this project is called our Learning Showcase. Okay. And a showcase is where people go to display, show other people their best work. All right. Like an art showcase. You would bring your most fabulous painting that you've done and put it up with other people's paintings for everyone to see. All right, uh, there's lots of antique car showcases, really fancy, beautiful cars from, you know, 50 years ago that people have kept so nice and beautiful and they just park them all in a row and people can walk around and see, okay? So think of that, the word showcase. This is our learning showcase. You get to decide what reading or writing skill you are the best at. You don't have to be an expert at it, but which skill do you feel confident in? Either reading or writing, okay? There are three project choices for reading and for writing. So all together, you have six choices for your project. I think it's exciting. You're going to show all the other Magonistas what you have learned this year, what you feel confident that you know how to do. All right, so either gonna be something to do with reading or writing. Right. What I have done is I have created a choice board for you on a Google document. Okay, so attached to our assignment is going to be this Google document. It has the list of six choices, but it also has some simple directions on what to do for the project. And it has links that you can click on to go to project examples. Uh, or to go to videos that I found that might help you complete your project, right? So this is something that you're going to do at home during this quarantine time. All the projects that I have, um, all the project choices I have made for you are going to be simple things you can do at home. You might need a phone to record a video or some other kind of technology to record a video, but that would really be the only special thing. Paper, pencils, um, colors are, that's really all you might need for this. You could always make it more creative though and add in special things that you have at your house. Anyway, you'll get to see uh, when you look at all the project options. I'm really excited. Right? You get to show what you've learned. You get to make it as challenging as you want or as simple as you want. Right? You are just going to show all of us how much you've learned so far this year. And we will showcase them. Right? You get a chance to show them to the other Mabonistas in our class. I'm so, so, so excited about it. So, again, this project, right, is something that you're going to work on for about the next week and a half. Okay, it's going to be due on May 27th. Okay, today you're getting all the instructions and your choices of project. Okay, today you're only job is to choose what project you want to do. 
come up with a little idea on how you want to do it. Now, my niece says, yes, we still will be having some reading lessons. Um, you know, days of the week along with this project, but I'm not going to give you too much work to do. Okay, and I'm definitely going to take one or two days off during the week for us to be able to just focus on the project. And of course, I'll be on Zoom answering any questions you have for this project. All right, Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays, I get on at 11. And Tuesdays and Thursdays, I'll be on at 10 a.m. All right. I'm there for a whole hour, okay? So pop in when you can to ask questions about the project. I'm super excited, Magones says. Yay! Look out for more videos on directions as well. Love you. Bye!